Hey water signs, welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today's just gonna be a quick message for the water signs. So if it resonates, also appreciate you subscribe, like, share those things that resonate too. I do appreciate you. Any other information you need to know is down below. See you not but love, peace, and blessings. All right, this is for my Cancer Scorpios and Pisces. Yeah, I know I look toe up and tired, but it's it's nighttime. I don't give a damn. So maybe that's what y'all want. Y'all just don't give a damn. Like I feel like people, society always trying to make people. Like, I don't, I don't, maybe you tired of that. you like, I'm going to be who I want to be and I'm going to be comfortable. Okay, so, yeah. What we have for water signs, <laughs> you comfortable in your own skin. I'm also getting, like, you want to be around people that you're comfortable being around, okay? Because you are an empath water sign. So, I do feel like you tend to kind of, like, get, like, annoyed or something. Or you you tired of feeling other people's negative energy. Yeah, the King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. You looking for a healing relationship? Somebody treat you right? Some of you guys are newly single. Yeah, you're looking for a commitment. Okay, some of you guys want to get married. The judgment card here. Some of you guys want a traditional marriage. Okay, somebody could be a tourist. Yeah, the 20th could be very significant. The magician here. 2020 could be significant. January the 20th. I'm also getting on uh, 201. Somebody daughter could be 201 or number five. I have a five in it. 1205. I don't know. I feel like you dealt with somebody that turned you off here, okay? They put all the weight on you. And I feel like you guys had different views or like this person that you was dating while they signed, they were trying to make you insecure. Like this person is like a narcissist. And then this person was trying to make you think like you can never heal. They kept on trying to trigger you. It's a lot of like mind games. You could have been dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Yeah, but I do feel like you you ain't dealing with that no more. So, that's good. This time around, I do feel like you're ready for a healing relationship, a down-to-earth relationship. Not something you have to impress everybody in their mama, okay? All right. You could have even, for some of you guys, you could have been in a polygamous relationship. And you like, I'm not going to let you feed off my insecurities no more. I want to be the only one. Yeah, you definitely broke up with somebody where it's fine. Yeah, I hate that. I love you. Maybe you still love this person or this person still obsessed with you. You better not go back to no no person who playing with your mind like that and playing off your insecurities. Like this is the energy I'm getting. I can see your true colors. That's why I love you. Okay, this person loved you because you were genuine, heart on ice. But why their heart was on ice? Yeah, they gave you a love offer involving their baby mama. They want to be with you and their baby mama. Mop stick here. Okay, they're getting their karma. Somebody getting their karma for trying to take advantage of you. And I know what people say is like, you only do what people allowed you to do. But what if the intentions were pure? What if your intentions were pure and this person's intention was to play off your insecurities? Maybe you was like, well, I'm going to do anything to make this person happy. And they took advantage of that in a negative way. That's what I'm getting here. It's a whole lot of manipulation here. Okay, somebody was doing sex magic. All right, somebody's about to, um, somebody's about to get some karma. All right, what else do we have here? The nine of wands, the empress card. Yeah, you, you're not messing with this person no more. I feel like mm -mm, everybody who come in quickly, like, get out my face. The full card here. Yeah, because you're looking for the one. You see how you got the two stabs in both pictures? It's like you're using your discernment because somebody's trying to portray like they're the one for you. But you automatically know they're not. I feel like you know what you're manifesting here, okay? It's all in the conversation. Maybe you speaking to them and something that they say. It's like somebody that says something the same way in the past. Yeah, number four, number eight could be significant. The next 48 hours could be significant. Something about when you was 19. I don't know. I just feel like, or you could have been married before and your first marriage was terrible. And now you like, you want something different for your second marriage or just in a long-term relationship. I don't feel like you want flings, okay? I feel like your fling stage is over or you just like, I'm not with that no more, okay? I feel like somebody's mad that you don't, you don't want to fling, you don't want to play these games with them, all right? Yeah, calm, cool, calm, collected. Yeah, stay cool, calm, collected. You getting what you what you asking for. <laughs> it's happening, okay? You are protected, okay? Somebody was trying not to wear protection with you to trap you. Somebody had an SED. You dodged a bullet. Spirit is definitely leading you to a winner. Okay, this could be somebody who has their own business or business minded who can help you grow in the right direction. You're looking for somebody to grow with. Yeah, 
because somebody showed it true colors they was only for the streets here they was just looking for an adventure and to be a narcissist now they want to come in and say sorry now they need your help because they're going through karma they're trying to think of ways to get back to you they're trying to bribe you back into their life because they need your good luck be mindful they're trying to manifest you back but it's not for the right reasons okay i feel like um yeah, what? Like, what's the end on be all? Thank you, spirit. Yeah, the star card could continue to heal. This could be within Aquarius who is not healing, okay? Their plan of trying to put all this weight on you, all the bills on you, all the stress on you. It didn't work because you left there. Yeah. The tables are turning. Like, dang, keep on going. So, y'all hear that, right? So, like, somebody could be, like, going to the hospital or something. Like, this person could be getting sick, shot, or something like that. Somebody getting their karma for how they treated you. Somebody did not know who you were. Maybe you weren't their only victim, though. I feel like they have other victims here. This could be some type of cult energy. And I'm getting, like, mastermind man type of energy. You know, how they manipulate vulnerable women. All right? celebration somebody was in a call somebody was in a call whoever watching this if it's not a call a polygamous relationship basically a call for some of you guys this person was trying to um put all their views on you brainwashing you you had to get um brainwashed by somebody who was playing with your mind okay yeah celebrate you get to celebrate you dodge the bullet open your heart to receive new love better days are ahead yeah get into nature breathe you can breathe again. Yeah. Somebody about to be a billionaire. Or your abundance is being a lot. Spirit had to put your abundance on hold. Because somebody was definitely trying to take that thing. Yeah, you were just trauma bonding with this cult leader. Didn't I say that? Somebody's a cult. You was trauma bonding with a cult leader. This cult leader was trying to um brainwash you by using your um insecurities or what you went through. And turning and twisting and turning and twisting and turning your mind around, trying to trauma bond with you to re trigger you to hold you back. All right, close off your heart chakra so that you don't go out there and see new love. So you could stay with them, stay stuck with them, and it didn't work. So you dodged a bullet. Somebody could be dark brown skin. You paid attention to the red flags. Child, love you guys.